Hey there, this is Vassar Vimes, and welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 2. We're in an odd kind of limbo space right now between the end of the main Mass Effect 2 story and the beginning of Mass Effect 3. Uh, I've just been running around accepting congratulations from my teammates, as you do. Uh, but once I've finished that, it'll be time to rescue Admiral Hackett's old colleague and see what info she has on an impending Reaper invasion. What do you have to say about that mission, Said? Was it worth the pay? Thinking about past missions. Why? Got a minute. You might learn something. You should be thinking about what we just did. Joker handled himself well. Should have come back here and got a real weapon. Yeah, there wasn't any time. Joker did real well for a kid with glass bones. Pretty sure I'd be laid up in bed if I were him. That's very generous of you. Thank you, Zayn. Can't say I blame Taylor's pop. A man does what he has to do to survive. You're gross. Ran up against a Batarian camp, not too different from that one. Job was to erase the whole thing from the map. Men, women, and the man in charge. Learned that day that despots are cowards. You show them you're in charge, not them, and they cry like little girls. And did you wipe everyone out? I should let you go. Talk more later. Alright, I don't like that he agreed with, uh... Jacob's father, that's messed up. Is that a worthy enemy? Now what, what's gonna happen now? Can you wait a little until the Reapers get here? We fought a great battle, Shepard. And when you blew up the base instead of handing it to Cerberus, ha! <laughs> I'm glad you approve. Think about if you killed the most dangerous thing in the galaxy, that leaves us. So we're the most dangerous thing in the galaxy? That's a good assessment. I like it. That's all for now. I like being Shepherd. dangerous. Did you have fun, Jack? You were invaluable. You were so great. Hey. Are you serious? You don't have anything to say? What's happening? Shepard, we talked enough. All right, You're just fine. messing around. No hard feelings, but I, I don't go. Want... Whatever. I can't believe that she doesn't have anything to say about that huge mission where she helped a ton. Like, she was fantastic. I just want to quickly see whether they have anything to say. Yes, no? Thanks for coming to get us, Commander. No I problem. I myself slipping away. You arrived just in time. Thank you. She kind of looked like the one that, uh, that died right in front of us, too. Uh, that's kind of creeping me out. That was... Oh, uh, that was disgusting. Carry on. Will do, Commander. And last but never least... Tally. I can't believe we destroyed the collector base. Right? We're awesome. Be done. Then again, that said about a lot of things you do. Too true. Too true. I'll let you work. Talk to you later. Alright, now that my ego has been boosted, I can go and save that lady. I, I don't get to choose any squad mates. Okay. I saw that, uh, oh that's right, he wanted me to go alone. But I saw that this is a, a Batarian planet, and I have a wish list. For this DLC, I want it to have lots of stuff on the Batarians. And I'm kind of dreading how terrible I'm going to be by myself, because I still don't really have any offensive powers. <laughs> That's what I should have done before this. I should have, like, just got some offensive powers. Oh well. Hello? It's all kind of grimy and rainy. It's a little bit like Pragia. Pragia? Pragia? Oh, hello. Okay, there's Baron in here. Maybe I should switch to... This. Hello? Do I need to do something else before I do this? Maybe. They seen us. What? They? Just a little doggy. The Batarians must send their prisoners down here to die. I have to find Dr. Kenson now. Right, Dr. Kenson. 
Oh, okay. The bridge has been fixed. Probably more Varen around here. It's all these dead Varen. Oh, I saw one. Oh, I saw you. You cannot hide from me. You trying to make Varen scary? Even for a prison. Oh! Okay, it did startle me, but it didn't scare me, okay? Why did I even cut that power? That didn't do anything. Get your hands off me! Well, obviously I can't go through there. It's gotta be a place to cut off the power. Am I ever going to get Pat back to that point? Well, no, I need the other one back too. Okay. Is this supposed to be some kind of puzzle? And I lose, use the term loosely. Should I have gone there, up there first? It didn't tell me where to go. Okay, if that's where I'm supposed to go, then hang on. Hang on one hot second. Literally. I hear humans are scurrying like vermin out in the asteroid belt. We should arm a mission to flush them all out. Hmm. I kind of still feel like I, I have this suspicion that there's probably some foundation to what they're complaining about. Because I've met a fair, a fair few humans in my time, and they can be shitheads. So I would not be surprised if that were the case here. Are they talking about Kensum? Because that would be really shitty. Please don't slam asteroids into the mass relay. I need that to get places. So far, no combat. They've still oh. got her down in the prison. i just kill her. Interrogating a human's a waste of time. Can we, like, sneak by them? It's a weird change of pace where we actually have to be stealthy, potentially. I don't know, we haven't been forced to confront them yet. I can actually go around them, that's pretty cool. I'd rather not just kill people that are just doing their jobs. Where am I supposed to go? This way. Okay, hang on. Oh, they're over there. Crap. <laughs> Wait, so can I just go down here? Oh, there we go. All right. What was that? I like this. It's kind of tense. A little bit like a, a stealth mission, but I mean... No way of Not really, because it's still just mass effect. Much less destroy. Those humans will do anything to destroy. I swear. We have to take one and again to the others. We can't respond kindly to terrorists. 
Is Hackett's friend a terrorist? I don't really want to help a terrorist escape. It's not what I really wanted to do with my day. I also want to listen to that log, though. Fuck. No! You guys can hear way too well. be able to actually stealth it up a little bit. I'm not very good at stealth games, but I'm sorry. I didn't know anything. Sorry, buddy. I just want to listen to this. Wait, there was a log. Oh, there it is. I know, fucking humans, right? Three hundred thousand. Is that usual? I don't know. I have no scope of what's normal. I do kind of like that there was the opportunity to um, to not hurt those ones, those particular battalions. Back, back at the beginning. <laughs> flags. We are, we are very much into flags. Oh shit! <laughs> Is this another pseudo puzzle thing? What am I picking up? That box there. No. Why am I moving boxes? I don't really know why we're why we're moving boxes. Does that do anything? Because I can still get down here. Alright, that was fun. I'm glad we did this. Oh my kid. What was that? I thought that was going to actually turn into something, I and mean, then it was just like, nope, you can just move boxes around. Our convoy intercepts paid off. We picked up a message to the Alliance coming from somewhere in the asteroid belt. We listened to the feed until we discovered an operation run by a human named Kenson, smuggling engine parts and guidance systems into the system for Omega. We intercepted Kenson's vessel and took her and her people into custody. Interrogation has produced nothing but frenzied rambling so far. Okay. Is Kenson, like, in- oh. Involved with this asteroid thing? Or is she just kind of infiltrating an organization? Can we sneak by these guys? There's an intercom that we can listen to. Kind of nice that there's actually alternate routes that you can take. Usually we can't do that. You look like Chakwas. In that you are an old woman with the same hairdo. Who are you? What are you doing, Dr. Kenson? I'm Commander Shepard. I'm here to get you out. Commander Shepard? I'd heard you were alive. Hackett must have received my message. Yep. That is exactly what's going on. We're not safe here. Can you walk? That was some Jack-style badass, right? I'm fine. Just give me a moment. We have to go. Now. If we can find a console, I can hack security. Make us an escape path. Okay. She's a tech sort. Can we sneak by them? Then we'll find one. Go! Hey! Ready. I don't know what it is. I just have this kind of like soft spot for Batarians of all people. 
I just have this feeling like, well, as I already said, that we did something to deserve how much they hate us. There, I assume. No, 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 I didn't want to jump over that. Fuck. <laughs> Accidental leaping. Okay. Hang on, can we? Okay, no, I can't. Because she appears to have some powers, but I can't upgrade them, I guess. I don't know why. Um, I also want to change weapons. How are we for our enemies? We're pretty good. Alright. Oh. Ah, fuck. Incinerate, though, I am a fan of incinerate, so I'm not going to let it get force in the mouth. <sighs> Need to remember to use my assassination cloak. Because I never, ever do. <laughs> All of the ammo in the world. Security console. That sounds important. What's that? There was like a little. Never mind. This is what we need to find for Kenson, yes? They know we're here. Keep them off me while I hack us away out. That sounds like a drag. Oh, it's like at the beginning with them. Um, where am I going? Which way am I supposed to go? Back in there? Why? <laughs> Everything is just on fire in general. And I need shields in a big way. <laughs> Not being an infiltrator in this moment. <laughs> At all. Okay. We need to close the door we came in through. Keep them out. Which door did we come in through? I forget entirely. They're coming through that door in the back. Lock it down. Is this 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 one? Oh. They're coming up from below. Other side, go. Hmm? I guess just run to the opposite side. And stop telling me what to do. <laughs> I don't like your attitude. I'm the leader on this mission. Let it burn inside the mission below. I know you're dead. Oh, hello. I didn't think there was anybody else here. What? Am I supposed to do something? I thought that I would What's have to. What? What? More enemies on the elevators. What? Oh, okay. I thought that I would have to <gasps> close another door. I guess not. Maybe I was just in in Garrus recruitment mission <clears throat> mode too much. Not everything is the same. That's good. I Almost done. Come on. Ah! That was dash cunning of you, sir. More of them. My shields are down. Okay, then put more shields up. See how that works? Pretty basic. I need some ammo. That did it. Let's move. Okay. Onto the elevator? Which one? Over here? I think that's already pretty much a done deal. 
We'll have to get those open the old fashioned way. What's the old fashioned way? They're here! Blowing them up? Probably. <clears throat> kind of, when in doubt, blow shit up. Not a whole lot of people here. Apparently. Oh, there's a couple. Is there anyone behind me? No? We're good. We are fantastic. Oh, there's more. Someone coming up the other way. Yeah, I'm gonna focus on you instead. Oh, it actually would have been used. Yeah, that would have been actually more useful. Forgot about using overload because I haven't really used it in a while. Cloak and snipe. Snipe this snipe. There's something to blow up over here. <laughs> I really wanted to blow it up. Is that actually? It is actually shoot the thing? It is. Wow. That's the old fashioned way. Now what I'm doing. Just get in the shuttle? Probably. There we go. Adios. Oh, not a good way to go. Engaging autopilot. We should be well out of range before they get their security measures unscrambled. Do you think they'll come after you? I'm not taking any chances. Batarians don't take kindly to humans who plan to destroy their mass relays. See, so, so the charges against you are true. Well, to be fair, that's about half the story. What's the other half? And I we're here investigating rumors of Reaper technology out in the fringes of this system. I guess you found something. We found proof that the Reapers will be arriving in this system. When they get here, they'll use its mass relay to travel throughout the galaxy. Okay. We'll call it the Alpha Relay. From here, the Reapers can invade anywhere in the galaxy. So you decided to destroy it. Exactly. Doing that would stop the Reapers' invasion. What? Even at FTL speeds, it'd be months or years before they got to the next relay. We came up with what we just called the Project. A plan to launch a nearby asteroid into the relay and destroy it before the Reapers could arrive. Of course, the resulting explosion would probably wipe out the system. Okay, then we can't do that. What else can we do? I've always heard that mass relays are indestructible. I don't I've really care that, whether they are. But I think it's more that nobody's willing to find out what happens when one is destroyed. Didn't you just say and, it's gonna blow up the place? Well, we plan to slam a small planet into the thing at very high speed. By our calculations, that's more than enough. Which planet? This seems like a terrible idea. What? <laughs> this is ridiculous. How did you plan to launch an asteroid into a mass relay? Moving an asteroid just requires thrust and guidance, which are readily available in Omega's salvage yard. <laughs> Get the right what amount a place. of power and a good VI to drive it, and you can pretty much just point and shoot. That's so encouraging. Good God. Is the project still operational? I, I imagine it is. We were one button press away from launch when the Batarians arrested me. We're being awfully chipper about this. Yeah, the, ex the, the explosion bit. That's kind of what I'm hung up on. Why do you think destroying the mass relay would destroy the entire system? Mass relays are the most powerful mass effect engines in the known galaxy. The energy released from a relay's destruction would probably resemble a supernova. But people live here. This is a remote system, but just over 300,000 Batarians live on the colony where they held us. The explosion would undoubtedly kill them all. Okay. Pretty easy decision then. Because, I mean, this measure would only delay the Reapers. It wouldn't stop the Reapers. 
Seems like it's building up to a choice, and it. I, I don't. I don't think I'll be too stumped. How are you caught? We've been smuggling starship parts from Omega, thrusters, guidance, an aftermarket Ezo core. The Batarians thought that looked suspicious. A few days ago, I took a few of the men on a scouting trip, and the Batarians pounced on us. They never found our actual base. Okay. What do you mean you need more proof? Proof of what? I still don't see how you learned about this supposed invasion. The evidence came from what we okay. call Object Row. A Reaper artifact we discovered among the asteroids near the relay itself. When we get back to Arcturus Station, I'll explain everything and provide copies of all our notes on the artifact. Alright. How exactly does a Reaper artifact give you proof of an impending invasion? It showed me visions of the Reaper's arrival. Much like your Prothean beacon, I imagine. The Reapers are coming, Commander. That much I know for certain. Well, so do I. There was a clip at the end of the game. And it showed us that the Reapers were coming. This is not news. What's a Reaper artifact doing in an asteroid? We don't know. Or even what its purpose is. Some things are just too old or large to comprehend. Even a Reaper thousands of years dead contains power. Their artifacts are worthy of study, regardless of their purpose. If you're working near a Reaper oh, yeah. artifact, how have you avoided indoctrination? Good point. We've been very careful. We oh, know well, if you're careful. Are. You're not speaking to a child, Shepard. I think I am. I saw what Sovereign did at the Citadel. Trust me. I know what's at stake. Because you think it's it's acceptable to want to work on this project. The stakes are too high. If you were willing to destroy a whole system over this, I want to see your proof. I don't care I guess what the I proof can't is. I can't argue with that. Give me a moment. Kenson to project base. I can hear your voice, Doctor. You coming home? Affirmative. And I've got Commander Shepard with me. Shepard? Really? Tidy up the lab. The commander needs to confirm the artifact. Right. I'll get everything set up for your arrival. Uh, project base out. All set. Just sit back and relax. We'll be there in no time. She's being very calm about this. So that's the asteroid that's meant to collide with the mass relay, I assume. Here we are. Welcome to Project Base. What's this? That's our countdown to arrival. When that gets to zero, they said the thing. The Reapers will have come. Just over two days and counting. What? Puts things in perspective, doesn't it? Two days. <laughs> okay. Well, I can kind of see why it's a little bit more of a, a choice, because like we have two days to prepare and whatnot. How do you know that's an accurate countdown? It is. The artifact has been giving off pulses at definite intervals since we found it. The intervals have been decreasing at a steady rate. The artifact is reacting to the Reaper's proximity. In just over 48 hours, the pulses will become constant, and the Reapers will be here. Well, perceptibly con constant to the human ear. It's not the same thing. You're saying the Reapers could be at Earth in two days? There's no time to waste. Then let's show you that proof. That door exits the hangar. The artifact is in our central lab area. We should be preparing for, like, the Reapers to get here, not planning on trying to destroy the Batarians. Go through the door at the end of that corridor to your left. I'm getting a little bit nervous because it kind of seems like... Like Shepard is... Just kind of. So what would why don't I have a project back up and running? What's, what is Everything going on with the shadows in here? Arrested. It wasn't a question of could we, but should we? Well, that that's a valid question. It kind of seems like Shepard is on board with this, and I kind of want it to still be in question, because I'm not comfortable with killing three hundred thousand Batarians. 
That does not seem cool to me. What alternative do we have? The Reapers will reach this system regardless. But the Alpha Relay is their shortcut to the rest of the galaxy. But they can... If you want to keep the Reapers at bay, this relay must be destroyed. But it only... Like... It only delays them. We have to get the project running again. It's probably the only chance we have. So Shepard is just understood to be One on second. board. Let me get the door. Commander Shepard, I give you Object Row. Do you have the Reaper artifact just sitting here? Yeah. Out in the open? There's no way they're not indoctrinated. When we found it, it showed me a vision of the Reaper's arrival. Kenson, this is not good. Give it a moment, Shepard. It'll give you the proof you need. I don't want proof. I'm... <laughs> I'm blue now, and I don't know how to deal with that. I can't let you start the project, Shepard. I can't let you stop the arrival. <sighs> so why, 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 why did you tell me all that? Take her down. Well, oh, crap. They've seen us. There's us. There's no us. You were easy. Where'd you go? Come back up. Where's everybody? Oh, they're all on that side. Okay. That was a completely useless assassination cloak. Everything difficult. Give yourself over and be spared. It's like Harbinger again. Is it Harbinger? Could be Harbinger. Maybe he's a big man in the in the world of Reapers. We could really do with a squad mate right about now. Entirely too many people to deal with. Oh shit. Oh, that's not good. Okay, I need this. I think you do. I think you do. What with the shooting at me? Project Elite? Well, isn't that fancy? This is a lot of indoctrinated people. Well, this, I mean, it's somewhat... I don't know whether it's promising or not, because... That sucks. That's the worst time for a reload. The end of your will come. Oh, how how long is this gonna go for? Is this finite power level? Is this power level going up or going down? I haven't really been I haven't been paying attention to that. Or is it due to how close I am? Maybe? I don't know. Target's closed. Oh shit. 
ran out of ammo. Stop, drop, and roll. Stop, drop, and roll. I always thought that was going to turn out to be more important in life, you know? I've taught it so much that. A heavy mech? What the hell is this fight? It's just not fair. Can't even see anything. Is there someone behind me? No. I need shields. I'm gonna die at any second. Weird. Weird place for cover. The uh this is coming out. This sucks. What's with this? What's with what I'm turning red. You mean I could have given up any time I wanted? <laughs> That's Great. <laughs> so it was gonna start the next scene as soon as I died. I Thanks feel positive about this. Up. We want Shepard alive. Like Shepard was waking up a moment ago. But it could be a glitch in the system. This is happening again. Uh, no glitch. The sedatives aren't working. Security! Yeah. <laughs> so there. Can I... I can't save. This episode is going to turn out to be really long. I want to save. Ooh. That's cool. I'm sorry, lady. Oh, hi. Systems engaged. Hmm. Systems active. Can they do like? No, they they, they can't do my life. Well, we're engaged. Rerouting power. Can't say what the shit. Okay. Shh, stop talking. I'm just going to <laughs> stop here because the episode is way over. Um, when I continue, I'm going to try to escape this weird place. I have no idea where this DLC is going. It seems like it's in a strange place, morally. Anyway, until I get to, uh, until I come back, everybody stay peachy.